and we'll begin in Georgia with one of the best players in the 2021 class. That's this week's five-star feature. Matthew Cleveland may not be the most outspoken athlete you'll meet, but he is getting more comfortable using his voice. Over the last year or so, as he's seen calls for change, particularly from professional athletes he admires, he understands that his voice can make a difference. Uh, instills hope that it's just not like us, like little people that are seeing that's going on, but like the bigger people in the world, athletes, they understand what's going on and they can relate to it as well. He's actually, I think, done a really good job of sort of taking this all in. I know that for him, you know, watching all of this as with any teenager and particularly any uh, African-American young man, it's a lot to absorb. I feel very comfortable talking about it, just all types of things, Black Lives Matter, uh, things like that. And it's just, I feel very comfortable with it, just making sure you do it the right way, making sure you're not putting down anyone, but uplifting everyone at the same time. Whether it's in the community or on the basketball court, Matthew goes about a lot of things the right way. Coach Sharman White at Pace Academy can testify to that. He's coached Matthew since he transferred to Pace two years ago. He really loves the game. He's the first one every day at practice to be out on the floor, dressed, ready to go, getting shots up. It's small in, in, in stature, but it really means a lot as a coach when you see guys that, that consistently every day is the first one, getting the ball off the rack, you're going to get shots up. It's just good to be able to coach a kid like that. He has really hit his stride here, uh, both athletically and academically. The biggest thing I wanted him to get from coming here and being with Coach White was just the, the structure of winning, the culture of winning. Probably no place better than to have him here with Coach White. Matthew is one of the most talented players in the 2021 class. He's a five-star prospect and an All-American candidate. The six foot seven inch forward can dominate a game from the perimeter or in the paint. High energy, uh, really good at finishing at the rim, good mid range and just being competing at all, all types of level on the court. Uh, I think he does a lot of everything. I think when you try to categorize him as a guard or as a wing, I, I mean, he rebounds like a like a you know power forward and he takes the ball up the floor like a point guard and he, you know, passes like a point guard and he shoots it well. Trying to characterize him as a particular position, I think you're limiting him. I think he does a lot of things well. I think he'll find his niche uh, at the next level uh, just based on his ability to play the game. Matthew loves a challenge. While he probably won't be playing in front of big crowds this year because of coronavirus restrictions, he relishes the opportunity to silence the opposing student section. Just the atmosphere, a big rival away game, the atmosphere, the fans, just knowing that you can go in there and beat them and ruin their night. Next year, Matthew will get the chance to quiet some crowds in some of the best arenas in college hoops, as he'll be playing in the ACC with Florida State. While he's talented enough that he could jump to the NBA in a year or two, Matthew has big goals academically as well because it's important to him that he has a plan beyond basketball. We know kind of what, what track he wants to be on, and he's worked hard to be on that track, to be considered a, a prospect to go to the pros, even beyond college. But what do you want beyond basketball? Uh, what does that look like? Uh, he's interested in law school. He's a good kid. He really is. He's, particularly here lately, expressed interest in sort of protective services, you know, police work, investigative work, that kind of thing. But I, he really he comes by it honest. And that is, he cares about protecting others. Uh, he cares about trying to make sure that people are not in harm's way. Whether it's on the court or off, Matthew Cleveland has the potential to be a difference maker for years to come. And he credits his family for keeping him on the right track. They're just really big influences and role models on my life. Just being like Christians, just keeping Christ first in everything that we do. And also just making sure that you don't forget people where you came from and just always being nice and kind hearted because you never know what's gonna happen down the road. What I see is a, is a young man that's really driving to be the best he can be, not just on the floor, but in the classroom. He got great parental support, he has great two parents that, that do a lot to make sure he's in the best position he can be in. And I think he's just reaping the, the benefits of just uh, working hard and, and being consistent with what it is that he does. Thanks for checking out Sports Stars of Tomorrow on YouTube. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a like and please subscribe to our channel so you see all of the latest content.